So this is going to be kind of um, a vlog, you know, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Um, we're we're doing Fourth of July weekend. We're going to Booth Bay. Um, my stitches are out. Um, we'll see. We'll see how I do. Anyways, um, Booth Bay Harbor, Maine is just a really a beautiful place and Jay and I go there quite often actually. And we usually camp in a place called Shore Hills Campground, which is really cool. So a little bit of the, um, the sort of mid coast Maine for those of you that don't know Maine that well. And Booth Bay Harbor is one of the fingers. And usually while we're there, we take off and we go to many different other parts of it because the campground we're at is not sort of, um, it's not like we're gonna sit on the water's edge, although it, it does have a tidal pool, so to speak, or a little tidal uh, inlet. And you can go down and sit by the water there and enjoy some sunsets and stuff like that. It's tidal, so you wouldn't go swimming. It's kind of mooky bottoms there. But Booth Bay itself is just, just beautiful. So yes, um, this is something we do. We go probably Booth Bay Harbor a couple of times a year. And I'm gonna bring my bike. Jay's gonna bring his bike, although I doubt we're gonna do much bike riding. I have to be super careful on the sun. I can't get anything um, on my stitches area at all. And I'm working on you know, obviously my swelling. So anyways, hope you enjoy the vlog and you're probably going to see this late because, um, by the time I piece it all together, who knows? Anyways, um, yeah, hope you enjoy. all the way down to Bailey's and we're I just love this area it is so pretty I mean I wish you could smell the salt water you know the fresh air I, I wish I could bottle that and share it with you all but this bit of roadway going over to, um, to our final, final destination is a gift shop at the Land's End, I think it's called. I don't really remember, but you go all the way down to the very, very end where you cannot go anymore. And it's a perfect place for this little gift shop that they have there. And there's a beach, there's limited parking, but we've never had any problem finding parking. But when you get there, there's this beautiful beach and people that live in the area just go down and enjoy it. It's tidal, so I'm sure when it's super high tide, there's hardly any sand. And when it's super low tide, it's lots of sand, but this is a memorial for the fishermen that they have there. Just gorgeous lands, and you can see a little bit of the beach here. And then, of course, Jay and I have to do a selfie. We climbed up on the rocks, and I wanted to just take more of a panoramic view from that point. The beach is sandy, believe it or not, for the coast of Maine, and you just climb down there and you enjoy. You can have a picnic, or you can come into the store. They're now selling wine. How cool is that, right? I love some of the little things they have in there. I love you more. I, I wanted to buy that. It's so, so pretty. And then this doesn't really show that well, but it's um, it was pretty cool. And then heading back, we had to stop for a little bit more photo ops. And then when we got back later in the day, we went downtown Bar Harbor. I'm sorry, downtown Booth Bay Harbor. And because it was 4th of July, they had all sorts of little different celebrations out there. The sky was so hot that day, and the sky was all dressed up, carrying the flag, patriotic. So we didn't stay for the parade or anything of that nature, but my gosh, was it lovely. And this is a view of a little road on East Booth Bay. We've actually visited the folks that own this house right here, and they invited us to enjoy sunsets on their deck. Beautiful, beautiful spot. East Booth Bay, Maine love it this is called ocean point and i think it's all part of ocean point um, 
Mount Colony. I've taken many photos of the, uh, the pathway here. Ocean Point Inn is a gorgeous inn. Ocean Front, obviously, you can see that. There's a little bit of the road that Jay and I are riding on and people walk, and but it's just a, a gorgeous spot. We've actually stayed in Ocean Point Inn a number of times in the past. And, um, and that was before we got our motorhome. Then we started camping. We started to camp up in this area. Beautiful ride. I, I'm going to see if I can speed this up for you just so you can see the full ride going all the way down to Grimes Beach. There we go. I sped it up. You probably get seasick. But most of the homes in this area have actually been handed down from generation to generation. It's very rare that you see a resale. And when you see one, it usually gets scoffed up, especially as we get down to this, this end. Um, it's just Ocean Point, this whole area, and Ocean Point Colony, they've done an amazing job maintaining everything. So we are off again. How's your trip been, honey bunny? It's been- Very relaxing. We've had, we've had uh, a definitely a lazy, a lazy trip for us, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. We've done a little bit of here and there and a little bit of that, but <laughs> a little bit of this and a little, <laughs> a little bit, bit of that. that. But basically, um, I've been, you know, uh, low key on the sun and and uh, we both have an injury to our, <laughs> our leg. So, yeah, it's been one of those. So now we're heading down to get gas. I'm going to Walgreens to get some uh, medicine, Tylenol <laughs> and some scar stuff because my stary seri strips are coming off so once I put that once they come off I can put the scar uh, be gone or whatever it's called on so that's what we're doing and then we're gonna go to a place called Barter's Island it did take forever and that all that was for a little tiny boat that went by but a good old-fashioned swing bridge which I know we went under when we came out this way for our boat ride from Bath. <laughs> so I've taken lots of pictures of my scar just so I can remember it. And one night we had some pizza, homemade pizza. Oh my gosh, I love making homemade pizza. <laughs> and this is just a little bit of the view down at the other end of the campground by the water. It was really, really a pretty spot as much as we enjoy Booth Bay, and it was kind of low-key because of all the issues we had, um, we love it, and um, we'll definitely continue to go back. And then we had to say goodbye and make our way home. We came home and we had guests. My mother-in-law from Florida was up. We had a little outdoor barbecue, and we saw a, what I first thought was a bear, but it was a fisher cat. Hope you enjoyed the vlog, and I'll see you in my next video. Was that?